بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم اسٹوڈنٹس ویلکم ٹو آر کلاس ٹوڈے وی ہیو ٹو ڈسکس ایس ایل او فرام گریٹ سیون اینڈ اٹس آر یونٹ سکس لیٹس فائنڈ آؤٹ وچ از وٹ از دی کمپیٹنسی وچ وی ہیو ٹو لرن اینڈ وٹ از دی ٹاپک وچ وی ہیو ٹو کور ان ٹو ڈیز لیکچر سو لیٹس فائنڈ آؤٹ ٹوڈے وی ہیو دی کمپیٹنسی آف آرل کمیونیکیشن اسکلس اینڈ اٹ از آر لیکچر فائیو اے اینڈ وٹ از دی ٹاپک وٹ از دی ایس ایل اوز ایسنس وچ وی ہیو ٹو ڈسکس ٹوڈے دی ٹاپک از اٹینٹو لسننگ اسکلس اینڈ expressing experiences in a conversation so let's find out what the slo is the slo is demonstrate attentive listening skills towards other and be sensitive to the rules of turn taking and discord so we what we have to demonstrate as an slo what we have to achieve we have to achieve the understanding of attentive listening skills and secondly we have to understand the rules and the description of turn taking so in today's slo we will focus on attentive listening skills and the rules of turn takings and what the turn taking is and it they will these concepts will contribute to our overall competency of the oral communication skills let's go further here is the vertical linkage which you guys definitely got it let's go further we have a brainstorm activity what is the brainstorm prompt let's read it let's do a brainstorm activity why it is important to listen carefully and take turns when speaking in a conversation so uh, it's a simple brainstorming prompt what you guys think that why we have to listen the others very carefully in a very sensitive manner and why we have to respect the turns of ourselves and the others in our conversation so the answer is very simple if you guys don't listen attentively if you guys don't focus what the others are saying you will not understand what he or she is talking about and what you have to give as an answer or as an reply and if you don't follow the rules of turn taking it, the conversation will not be happen because if you don't respect the turn of the others and if you the others don't respect the turn of yourself the communication will won't happen because no one will understand what is going to be said and what is going to be presented so that's why turn taking and attentive listening is very important that's uh, let's find out what attentive listening is and what is turn taking and what are their rules to understand how we have to follow these rules in the conversation so let's find out attentive listening attentive listening means entirely focusing on what the speaker is saying without getting distracted and showing that you understand so what is meant by attentive listening attentive listening means that you listen someone very carefully very possessive manner you don't see here and there when someone is talking you don't do such type of stuff you don't have to play with your hands when someone is talking you have to listen him or her in a very attentive way in a very careful and in a sensitive way this is the attentive listening you listen someone in a very focused and undistracted way and this will make you guys clear what he or she is talking about so let's go further i hope you guys understand what the attentive listening is what the attentive listening do the attentive listening will helps you to understand others in a better and makes them feel values so when you listen someone in a very att attentive manner so you listen someone in a very uh, we can say that sensitive manner it will show respect for him or her when your teacher is talking when your parents are talking you what you have to do you have to listen them carefully you have to see them you have to make your face in front of them this will happen this will shows that you are giving respect to them and you are listening them in a very 
clear and compact way so that's why attentive listening is very important let's go further what we have next we have the turn taking so in a communication two things are very important first one is attentive listening listens other carefully and then the turn taking you don't have to interrupt the others and the others don't have to interrupt you when you are talking and what is it called to speak on your turn is actually turn taking and don't interrupt the turns of the other is the respect of the rule of the turn taking and if you follow the rule of the turn taking and if you follow the rules of the attentive listening the conversation will be successful so let's find out what the turn taking is turn taking is the practice of letting each person in a conversation speak without interruptions and taking turns sharing so thoughts so uh, i hope you guys understand what turn taking is turn uh, in urdu we can say it bari so what you have to do you have to take your turn take your place and then express your emotions or thoughts and when other is expressing his or her emotions you don't have to interrupt him or her so this is the turn taking and this which you have to do for an effective communication what turn taking ensures why the turn taking is important the turn taking ensures that everyone gets a chance to speak and to be heard so that's why turn taking is very important it will give a chance to everyone to present his or her point of view or his or her emotions you guys have witnessed that turn taking will not be followed in many of conversations in the tv shows or in the political debates but in the academic conversations we have to follow the rules of turn taking so what are the rules of turn taking let's find out here is the first rule wait for your turn firstly you don't have to speak on the turn of the other you have to wait for your turn and secondly give cues when your turn is done what you have to do secondly when there is your turn and you are speaking or expressing your emotions and feelings and thoughts and you want to stop and you want to conclude your turn you want to end your turn what you have to do you have to give cue to other what is cue cue like a sign or we can say that like a symbol uh, to others and uh, and what this cue indicate what this symbol indicates it indicates that you have done you have expressed your thought and you want to listen the others opinion and you want that the other will cont continue the conversation so that's why what you guys do for uh, giving such type of cues like you guys have to use the phrase like what do you think L let's take an example you guys you are expressing that i have very much pain in my back and i am suffering with the fever and i think that the the weather is not appropriate and the weather is like that everyone is sick what do you think so there the sentence what do you think is actually an indication or a cue for the other that you have concluded your you have concluded your stance you have concluded your talk and you want that the other starts his turn so that's why you can use the pause or the signal or uh, a gesture to uh, for the others uh, to indicate that you have done with your turn but all the pauses are not work as the cue of the conclusion you have to show respect to some pauses some pauses and some silences are not meant that the other has done these pauses may be to make emphasis or to uh, uh, to make emphasis uh, on a certain point or such type of pauses may be uh, maybe happens so because one is thinking or uh, thinking about something so that's why you have to respect the pauses uh, what is a pause a short silence doesn't mean you should interrupt it might be a natural pause natural pause we have pauses in the writing so that's why these are the rules of turn taking you which you guys have to follow in your conversation and if you follow the rules of turn taking and attentive listening what will happen the attentive listening and turn taking
थिंग आर इसेंशियल फॉर इफेक्टिव कम्युनिकेशन सो दे विल इन enlarge your oral communication skills and they will make you a good speaker and listener and good communicator so i hope you guys understand the uh, attentive listening skills and the turn taking and you guys have achieved the slo for the understanding uh, for for the sake of checking the understanding of the slo pause the video and go through this classroom activity let's go further what we have we have a simulation link this simulation will help you to understand the concept of turn taking and attentive listening and they this simulation will enlarge your understanding about the slo so let's go further we have a homework what you guys have to do in the homework let's find out make a group with your fellows and discuss the social evil of bribery take turns and listen carefully to others so we have to do a conversation we have to do a communication conduct a communication for the sake of uh, examining our slo either the slo is achieved or not have you guys understand the rules of turn taking or attentive listening skills or not so this homework will help you guys to evaluate either you guys have understandability or have used the turn taking and attentive listening skills or not let's go further we have a resource pack this resource pack will help you guys to find uh, uh, to understand the slo or to achieve the slo in a more compact and better way i hope you guys understand and you uh, this lecture will definitely help you to enlarge your oral communication skills i hope you guys understand the topic the uh, and achieve the slo if you find any doubt any confusion any question you guys ask in the comment section and ask from your teacher as well thank you very much allah